Football 101 with Coach Brett Bielema. Brought to you by Carl, the official health provider of Fighting Illini Athletics. Welcome back to Football 101. Martin O'Donnell joined, as always, by Coach Brett Bielema. Coach, tough game last week against the Hoosiers, but saw some good things in the trenches, both on the offensive side and the defensive side. Alex Palczewski, Johnny Newton played pretty well. Yeah, Johnny uh, just continues to be very impressive, I think, from the growth he had a year ago to where we are now. Uh, his football awareness, he had a lot of uh, early down pressures. You know, you know, as an old lineman, like early down pass sets are different than third down pass sets, right? You're at the line of scrimmage, it's tough to get your depth so a D lineman can take advantage of quick movements, and he did that, um, uh, really played at a high level. And then Palcho, for sure, uh, I think from that uh, first game to the second game, settled in. You know, all those old linemen, they took every snap, over 90 plays. Um, but the good news is they cleared the way for uh, Chase Brown, who uh, this week was named the national uh, uh, running back of the year for the Do of the week for the Doak Walker Award. So uh, a, a lot of really good things are happening on offense. We just got to put it all together. Well, and, and Chase Brown, I mean, he seems to be a guy that somewhat has been unsung over the past year or so. So nice of him to get that kind of recognition. You know, when I got here, um, just even in drills, I was like, uh, this guy's got something. And then, you know, last year he was a little banged up at the beginning of the year. And then at the end of the year, uh, you know, you've seen good running backs, really. Like, they, they learn to play with the tempo. They, they let the plays develop in front of them. They let old linemen do their work and let themselves uh, come in behind them. He's really become an all-encompassing back. I think he's an early down back with third down value for the next level. Uh, I know they like the way he looks, and, and the numbers he's put up for these first two games is pretty impressive. Well, and, and the really kind of interesting thing looking at this week against Virginia is, you know, second, you know, very high-quality opponent in a row, so two or three games against Power 5 competition. But what can you learn from that, and then what can you take from seeing an opponent like Virginia that you did play last year in you the know, conference? Very unique. Uh, Coach Mendenhall, who uh, had the team last year, um, uh, actually team qualified for a bowl game, but uh, just the decisions that, that happened there and unfolded, um, uh, Bronco left and, and they brought in an entire new coaching staff. So they got a new head coach, uh, Coach Elliott, longtime guy at Clemson, very, very respected in the uh, coaching fraternity. Um, brought in two new offensive and defensive coordinators as well as special teams coordinators. So even though we're playing the same team and a lot of the same players, they, they have different schemes really in all three phases of the game. Uh, but they're led by their quarterback. He's an exceptional player. Uh, a guy that last year, you had a lot of respect going in the game, but you'd learn to appreciate him uh, that much more. Very, very uh, active player, he kind of he's a lefty. He's a very unique preparation. Uh, defensively, they play very long. Uh, the kicking games are advantageous. Got a couple good returners, so a tremendous challenge in front of us. Yeah, another great opportunity. Well, coach, thank you for your time, and thanks for stopping by Football 101. Football 101 with Coach Brett Bielema, brought to you by Carl, the official health provider of Fighting Illini Athletics.